I'm really happy and it's my pleasure to introduce our fuel cell vehicle. So it was introduced as uh, at, uh, at uh, uh, H2Moves uh, project for the first time in Europe. So it was, I think, uh, 2011 May, and we are now operating this car um, since one year and five months, I think. And this is the final version. So what is now running at uh, Denmark and Norway is our test car version. And I can say that this is the uh, last uh, final development. So uh, compared to the test cars, what is running, uh, the test cars is a uh, you know, uh, made for Korean market. So the suspension and the driving feelings is for Korean, uh, but this is, uh, has, is modified for, uh, optimized for European people. So it will, you will have a much better driving uh, feeling and steering feeling. And also we have improved about 10% in the fuel economy uh, s since we developed the T-car, test car. So. Uh, you have a driving range of 588 kilometers now, so it will be uh, much better driving. Yeah. As we uh, participate in H2 Moves project, uh, we found that uh, the Northern Europe is a very, uh, you know, the optimum market for fuel cell cars. So uh, we decided to produce 1,000 cars. So H2 Moves uh, Scandinavia project was some kind of uh, momentum for us to further develop this car. And now we want to provide this car uh, up to 1,000 units till 2015, in mainly in European market, yeah. You know, we didn't know that there was this kind of H2 Move Scandivet project running, so we didn't have any information. We, uh, uh, the occasion was I participated FCHJU stakeholders meeting, and at that time it was, uh, end of 2011 and I just said uh, we are prepared to cooperate with, with, with uh, Europe and then uh, uh, Mr. Uli Bunga he just uh, came to me and asked uh, whether you have interest in uh, h to move Scandivia project so I said yes and it was the just start it, it happened like that without any strategy or with some yeah it's just uh, happened like uh, mm, oh, oh, what can I say it, it just happened yeah uh, in Korea, there is no 700 bar hydrogen station which can fill in three minutes. As we brought our car here, we found that uh, our uh, hydrogen system is not capable of doing that. And uh, we now have uh, you know, modified our system that it can be filled uh, fast. And what we, could fi uh, what we know now is the hydrogen quality of Europe is quite good. So. Uh, we have to analyze further, but what I think is uh, uh, our durability in Euro cars in Europe, the durability is better than the cars in Korea. Yeah, I'm very happy about that. Yeah.